Good morning and welcome to day 12 of One Lonely Owl's YouTube channel Vlogmas. My name is Terry and I will be your host today as I am every day. If you've been here before you would have seen me. Um, sounds like my voice is getting a little bit better so I'm really glad about that. And I just wanted to jump on this morning and say a quick good morning. I don't really know what I've got planned for today to be honest. I have a full day ahead of me of the world is my oyster, so to speak. So um, I just wanted to pop on early in the morning and think about it with you and see what what I might actually get up to today. Um, I haven't done my advents yet. I'll do those right after I finish chatting with you guys. Oh, I will show you what I, a couple of things I did yesterday. Nothing really exciting. I didn't record it, but I wound up, I had this giant ball of Bernat Comfort and it was um, all over the place, so I wound it into two separate balls. I used my mother-in-law's Stanwood ball winder because my ball winder is broken. I have ordered a new one from Polka Dot Creek, so I'll be picking that up probably tomorrow. Um, so yeah, I, uh, I did a little bit of yarn ball winding after I signed off from you and I, I lied. Yesterday I said I was going to finish the knitted mittens for the gift pile and then uh, I also mentioned that I was booking some doctor's appointments and all those types of things. I ended up getting an earlier doctor's appointment with my oncology team and one of the people on that team I was knitting her a pair of mittens and I put down the other mittens that I was working on and I picked up what I've been calling the Ireland mitts. I will insert a photo here or if I have some footage later you'll see that as well. But um, basically I took a skein or a, some leftovers of a skein of yarn from the Blue Brick which is my other favorite yarn dyer. They are out, based out of Ontario. Um, and the name of that was called Ireland. And I'm holding it together with a strand of mohair from Polka Dot Creek. So two of my favorite yarn dyers in one pair of mittens for my favorite oncology doctor, <laughs> who is from Ireland. That's why she gets those. So I will be finishing those today. All I have left to do is the thumb of one of them and then I'll probably do the thumbs of the other mittens at some point today as well. So that is most definitely on the agenda. I've got three thumbs left to knit so I'll get those done and then um, you'll have already seen my advent calendar. So I've got at least those things for you for today. And then, uh, probably going to cook some dinner. I'm not exactly sure what we're going to have just yet, but I'm going to look for something a little warm and cozy and get that in, probably in the crock pot or on a slow, low and slow heat. Low heat, slow timing. I don't know. Low and slow is my plan for the day. What else? Oh, um, I don't know if I'm going to do my sock advent calendar. If I, I'll, I might pick out a pair, but I'm currently wearing my DK socks that I picked out yesterday. And they're just squishy and lovely. And I'll be honest, I need to knit myself some more DK socks. These are so great. And they're very different. Very, very, very different feeling than your fingering weight socks that you're typically used to. Um, but I absolutely love them and I don't really want to take them off. So I'm probably going to leave these on for the day. So if you do see me pick out a pair, I may have them. I may change into them. I probably won't though, because I'm really enjoying these DK socks. Um, and if at some point I'm able, I will probably try to get outside. It is an absolutely beautiful day. My dog is currently sitting outside on the front deck in front of the door just soaking in the sun rays and enjoying himself out there. So it's a beautiful day to go out and get some vitamin D. So I may go out and um, do a small little walk. Even if I just walk to the mailbox, I will tell you I have this raspy voice has taken its toll. I Although I feel fine, trying to talk has been challenging. So And 
again, if anybody here knows me, knows that I love to talk, so if I can't talk, what can I do? Been catching up on some other vlogmas. I've been watching Woolly Mammoth, who was recommended to me a few days ago, and gosh, I just love watching other people just live their lives and have them be normal, just like mine, you know? Um, that's one of the reasons why I really wanted to become a podcaster was because, uh, like Kevin says from Needles at the Ready, it's nice to be part of a community of like-minded individuals. And Woolly Mammoth, for example, today the episode that I watched, the Vlogmas episode that I watched, she was just cleaning and tidying her house and doing laundry, which is what I spend most of my time doing. Um, so a little bit, it's a little bit frustrating when you're in the moment and you're doing it, but then when you realize that you're not alone, it's heartwarming to know that you're not the only one out there that struggles with the things that you struggle with. So there's that. I don't really have a lot to talk about this morning. Maybe I will pop back on later today. I don't normally do that, but um, it's it's early, relatively early still. It's only 10 to 10, and um, I haven't really done much of anything. So I'll do my advent calendars. I'm probably going to sit down and try to finish those three thumbs. And um, who knows, maybe I'll even do a little bit of wrapping. Maybe you'll see me do some wrapping today. I'll wrap up the... I have a pair of mittens for my doctor. I have a pair of mittens for my oncology doctor, and I have uh, that other gift knit that is waiting to be finished. So maybe if I get those done, I'll wrap those as well. Otherwise, if I don't see you, I will say goodbye here, because that does happen as well, where the day gets away from me. Um, but I will say goodbye here, and if I do come back, I'll say goodbye again. I will see you all tomorrow for day 13 of Vlogmas. Um, but... Until then, enjoy the rest of today's footage. Enjoy. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.